Okay, everyone. Um, if you're watching this video, um, you're probably gonna go back to school soon, like me. So, I prepared a little list for all of you. Um, now weather. One sec. Okay, so one. Uh, okay, whether you are going back to college for a semester, but I think that they don't have breaks really. Or if you're going to preschool for the first time and you're watching this. It doesn't matter what school you're going to. Um, you might want to do these. So I've created a list for you all of five things you're going to want to do whenever you're going back to school. So one, pick out some good clothes. Um, unless, if you don't want to go buy clothes, I don't think I will. Just, like, have some good clothes. Like, I've... I'm probably going to wear some clothes that I've, that you've seen in videos. Um, and hopefully people will like them. And if they don't, I don't really care that much. Okay, confidence. You're going to need that. That, because last year, for me at least, we started the year with Zoom, mostly. And so, that helped me go into the in-person, because I already knew some people. Um, like Squirefire56, I met him on Zoom. And then, whenever we were in person, I kind of knew him a little bit. Okay, be prepared to learn. That's number three. You're going to want, you're going to want to be prepared to learn. You're not going to want to be wondering, oh, when is this class going to end? Oh, when am I going to get to go home? Because then if you do, you're not going to learn anything. So, be prepared. And especially since you're going into the next grade, usually. If you're going into your next grade, it's going to get a little bit harder. And you're going to want to know what to do. You're not going to want to be thinking about a YouTube or music that you want to do once you get home. You're going to think, okay, I need to write this down. need to do this, do this. Um, number four is have a good sleep schedule. So during the summer, you may have been having a different sleep schedule like I have. Because during summer, I was going to bed later than I usually would. Like we were going to bed at 10 instead of 9 or something. So that meant I would wake up later. Which means I'm going to have a hard time getting up earlier for normal like school weeks. And today I went to bed last night i guess i went to bed earlier than i usually do and i woke up at like 5 30. i don't really know why then last but not least um you need good hygiene like something you're gonna need just if you're a guy or a girl i don't care you're gonna need some deodorant like this it's just a simple little bar you just use it like you would and then walk out the door um so with hygiene that means it doesn't just mean for some guys i know that some guys the stereotype i didn't do it because i didn't use it but don't just spray yourself with body spray and then that's a shower you need to take showers almost every night if you can um i need to get back onto that because with um, summer, you kind of get all of your normal habits. And also for hygiene, I don't know if this goes under hygiene, but you're going to want to do it. Little bonus here. Um, you're going to want to probably have a good breakfast. Because if you go to a school like I do, the breakfast and lunch there, it's not that filling. So either have a good breakfast there or be prepared for the day so you won't be completely hungry for all of it and also you're probably going to want to pack a lunch if you don't go to a school if you go to a school where the food isn't the best like i swapped to a public school instead of a private school because at the old school you would have to buy your food so i got used to packing food but then they started having free food at my public school that I go to right now and it's not that it's not the best okay so you're either gonna have um okay breakfast and lunch or or you're gonna have a good breakfast and you're gonna have a good lunch from home 
So those are just five tips from your friend Greasy Studios. Um, if you're not subscribed already when you're watching this video, please subscribe. It's not that hard and you can always change your mind later. Um, also like this video so that it gets recommended for more people because if we get recommended to more people, the bigger we grow and then the bigger we grow, the more I can teach people like this. And so, yeah, um, thank you for watching um, and have a nice day.